So today I'm talking about traveling with your mom. I want to give you some real life tips on how to manage this sometimes challenging but really rewarding situation. I recently got back from a trip to Maui, a seven day trip with my mother. We are almost 40 years apart and so, so different when it comes to our personalities, but we really are the best of friends. So here are my four tips for staying sane when on a mother-daughter trip. One, set your expectations in advance. I didn't really do a good job of this. For instance, are you both sharing the load 50-50? The planning load, the scheduling load, the packing and preparing load? Or is one of you the ringleader and the other along for the ride? Mom and I didn't really talk about this in advance and I found myself getting really frustrated when I felt like I was having to plan everything. I suggest for you guys, if you're planning a trip with your mom, make sure you talk about this in advance you know, just set expectations so that no one's caught off guard and no one has an incorrect view of what's gonna happen. Two, schedule me time. Unless you guys are carbon copies of each other because God knows my mom and I are not, you are probably gonna want to do some of your own things. I wanted to be super active. I wanted to hike, I wanted to paddleboard. I wanted to be really physical. I also wanted to be sociable. I wanted to go out and meet some people, um, have some nights on the town, and I knew my mom was kind of the by 9 p.m. winding down type of lady. I actually did a good job of telling my mom in advance, hey, I'm you know thinking about this, I wanna do these things, hope you don't mind. I also made sure not to let them interfere with anything that we had planned. So I always made sure, okay, I'm, I'm going to schedule my hike for you know 6 a.m., I'm gonna go out to this karaoke bar at night at 9 p.m. just so none of our um, special one-on-one -on -one time would be affected and you know I felt like that was courteous and that was fair and I suggest if you and your mom are different and you want to do some of your own things that you also have that discussion and so my third tip to you is use others as a buffer this is pretty much self-explanatory when you have other people in the mix it kind of takes the focus off you so that you're allowed a little bit of a break. I made efforts to plan a few activities where there were other people around so that you know they could um, take some of the attention off me so my mom would have someone else to talk to, so I could have someone else to talk to. No matter how close you are, there can be lapses and legs in conversation. And it's okay to take breaks and bring other people into the circle, a different perspective and a different outlook than the two of you. My fourth tip to you is really just, when in doubt, shut up. <laughs> to me, what that means is um, you might not always get along, you might disagree, you might see things differently, you might have different expectations, but she's your mom and she might not be around forever. She won't be around forever. Cherish the time that you have together. Take advantage of the experience. Um, you're building memories. You're discovering things, you're discovering each other. It's really, really rewarding and valuable quality time. I think the more that you just settle down and bite your tongue, no matter what may irk you, the better off you're going to feel afterwards. I could have done a better job at this. I'm not perfect. And definitely a few times my patience was tried. So mom, I love you. Sorry for being a little brat. I hope you forgive me. Really, I'm just so thankful that I had this time, that we spent this time together. And, and you know, I kind of pushed her a little bit out of her comfort zone, which is really fun. So those are my tips for traveling with your mom. I know it's a trend that seems to be growing. A lot of you guys might be planning these types of trips. I would love to hear about some of your experiences and some of the ways that you kind of manage the possibly stressful, possibly challenging situation of being on a trip with your mom. Please leave me a comment below. And if you wouldn't mind, I love the support. Go ahead and give me a subscribe over here and then if you are so inclined go ahead and watch my next video by tapping or clicking up here now I love you guys 
Thanks for watching and uh, aloha and mahalo.